Now guys, first let's say hello and welcome to the people who are new here and hello to all my people that's always here. I love y'all and I love y'all for coming back. Now, today, <laughs> I have to laugh this off, I decided to make some chocolate fingers. This is what something I make all the time, all the time, but for you lot, I decided I was going to change it up a little bit. I was going to go intricate detailing and um, try and make it a little bit bougier than uh, I normally make it. <laughs> it didn't work guys. It did not work. First things first, that's biscuits that you can see in front of you, crushed biscuits. And I added way too much butter to it. Normally I just use biscuits and I don't crush them. I just use the biscuit like a sandwich kind of thing. And I put the chocolate in the middle, caramel around it, then chocolate around that. That's what I would normally do. Well, no, I decided to go bougie. And I'm not gonna lie guys, this was nice. It was nice. But it was definitely a change from the one I normally make. <laughs> Now, there's way too much butter in my biscuit. Um, my sugar was way too hot. The sugar that you saw me just put on the stove, um, I just put four tablespoons in a pan. You're just supposed to leave it on a low heat until the sugar dissolves. It's not supposed to bubble, not supposed to boil, literally melt. That's all it's supposed to do. Now, there it is. Mine was bubbling. And then I decided to put the butter in way too early. I didn't even wait for it to cool down. Can you see that little bit of smoke coming off there? <laughs> yes, that shouldn't happen. <laughs> so instead of making a nice little caramelly flavored sugar, I made burnt sugar. Burnt sugar is nice, but it's normally for a specific recipe. You know what I mean, guys? So um, this was not what I was expecting, but it was nice. It was. I'm not going to beat it up because it was nice, but... I'm gonna have to make it. I'm just, I'm just, I'll, I'll post it just to let you guys know what not, what not to do. Yeah, that, that's why I'm posting it. Just to let you know what not to do. So here you go. Don't do this. <laughs> you can try it and it was actually nice. I'm not gonna say, you know what I mean? Take it completely out and you know what I mean? Forever. Try it. It was just literally burnt sugar caramel, some chocolate and some crushed biscuits like how crushed biscuits and sugar and no there was no sugar crushed biscuits <laughs> and butter but yeah guys it was lovely it was nice but i ended up chopping it all up and sticking it into some ice cream which was better <laughs> it was really nice then <laughs> but yeah guys i posted it just to show you what but you can still try this and do your own little thing if you're already a good cook and you know how to do the thing in the kitchen you know how to throw it down go in and you know what i mean do your own if you've never done it before, this is your own little idea now. You know how to start it. Even my, I don't know, why did I even put the chocolate? I normally just pour it on, but I was being, I only had one milk chocolate um, vegan bar and I had one milk chocolate, no, I had one dark chocolate vegan bar. So I ended up using both. <laughs> I ended up using one on one side and one on the other. But as I said, yeah, that's me melting the chocolate. As I said, prepare yourself properly. Don't do what I do. This video is to show you what not to do. All right, guys like share subscribe and let me know if you do really try this recipe um how it goes down for you you know what i mean i will do you a better one i'm gonna do the regular one i'm gonna stop trying to be bougie about it i'm just gonna do the regular regular one i did last time for me and the babies and it was good i ain't gonna lie to you, it was good so yeah like share and subscribe guys love y'all thank you for coming back and i'll see you soon